Hey everybody, the Gaming Guru 51 here, and welcome back to more Pokemon Crystal. In the last episode, we defeated the gym leader of Saffron City, and it was a little challenging, but not too bad, but at least we got our 10th gym badge anyways. In this episode, we're going to be spending the entirety of it exploring the wonders of Celadon City, so let's go ahead and just get right onto it. So this place is pretty big, so we're going to probably be spending the entire episode exploring around, and there's really no hidden items here, that is kind of disappointing. But there's a lot of things that we can do here. So if you go to the same place that we went to back in Red, Blue, and Yellow, Fire and Leaf Green, where we got an Eevee back in the original games, let's see what's here now, because I'm pretty sure there's going to be something around here this time around. So, let's see here. Let's talk to you. Let me recount a terrifying tale. Once upon a time, there was a little boy who was given a new bicycle. He wanted to try it right away. He was having so much fun that he didn't notice the sun had set. While riding home in the pitch black night, the bike suddenly slowed. The pedals became heavy. When he stopped pedaling, the bike began slipping backwards. It was as if the bike was cursed and trying to drag him to oblivion. Shriek! The boy had been riding uphill on cycling road. Bum For listening so patiently, you may take this TMO3. <laughs> I kind of figured the story was going to head in that direction based on the description. TM3 is Curse, a terrifying move that slowly whittles down the victim's HP. If you're a ghost type. If you're not a ghost type, it's going to lower your speed to boost your attack and defense stats. So I'm surprised they didn't make that clear in the description of the move. And I don't, I don't want to go back inside. Is there anything over here? Anything at all? There really should, you know, be an item somewhere. And the reason why I'm not using a bike right now is because I love this track so much. Even back in the first game, during Gen 1, well, Fire and Leaf Green. This Polyrath is my partner. I would wonder if he'll ever evolve into a frog Pokemon. That's actually false too! Polyrath cannot evolve again. It can only evolve from Poliwhirl into Politoed. Wanna know a secret? Celadon Mansion has a hidden back door. Ooh. How mysterious. Celadon Mansion. Let's go on through. We already went to the back exit though. So it's gonna talk to everybody here. My dear Pokemon keep me company, so I don't ever feel lonely. Meowth even brings money home. Oh, that's pretty nice. So I guess it has payday, right? That will bring money in after a battle, so it's pretty sweet. Let's see, is there anything special here? There's a PC. Nothing. Jamie turned the P Someone was in the middle of composing an email. I hope you'll come visit Kanto. I think you'll be surprised at how much things have changed here. You'll also see many Pokemon that aren't native to Johto. To the producer. Oh, that's pretty funny, actually. Let's go ahead and move to the next floor and see what we got. We got all these people here. Is that right? I'm the game designer. Filling up your Pokedex is tough, but don't give up. Yeah, we're not going to be doing that. Who, me? I'm the programmer. Playing the slot machines. Oh, no, that's not okay. Aren't the twins adorable? Jasmine's pretty cute. There are two. Oh, I love them. Yeah, he's happy about the female gym leaders. I'm the graphic artist. I drew you. <laughs> I love it. I think um, every game has a reference to the designers and all of them. High places. I do love them so. I say the only thing that loves heights as much as me is smoke. <laughs> oh, this game. This game is crazy. But all right, we've now explored all the floors here, so let's go on and get the heck out of here. Because there's really nothing else to do in this place. The only thing that was there to do was to get that H or that TM for curse, but hey. So here we have the Celadon department store. And the one thing that I'm really interested about are the TMs, if there is a TM section. But of course, you do have your normal items that you can buy here. So we're just gonna go through each shop individually and see what we get. Uh, this is, like I said, just a plain shop. And then you have this floor. Which I'm not even sure. Maybe has the vitamins or something. Oh, it's, this has TMs. So this is Hidden Power. Boost Fire Type moves. This must be Sunny Day. This must be Protect. Uh, Rain Dance. Flings damage every turn. Sandstorm? Yeah. I think that's Sandstorm. So it's just the weather moves. Not really useful that much. I should use a TM on. Oh boy. Uh, I wish they had better TMs. Like, I don't know. Fire Blast. But I think he windows through the game corner in Johto or something. Here we have 
a polka doll which you use to escape from wild Pokemon. I think I want to buy one of these. I think. Oh, I really can't carry anything else, really? That's so stupid. Oh, I really need to get my inventory together because I swear I have this problem almost once every other video and I need to put these four items in the freaking PC. I'll do that off screen at the end of the video for sure. So I'm not worrying about that. Now, who are these? I think these guys are selling vitamins. Uh, yeah, the X items on this guy's side and the other guy's going to have vitamins, which boosts your EVs of a stat by 10, I believe, and you can only use 10 of those vitamins per stat at a time. So that's pretty cool, I guess. Oh, there's ga no games here. I wanted to play. Go to the Celadon department store. Er, no. Go to the... the department store. No, go to the game corner. That's where you're gonna find the prizes. But, I think the fastest way to get here would be to use the elevator. Because it's an elevator. Elevators are pretty efficient at what they do, which is bring you to floors. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's get the heck out of here, and I want to check out the game corner, because games are fun, and why not? So here is the prizes. Uh, let's see, what can we get here? TM32. I'm going to show on screen what these actually are, because I really don't know. And I believe over here might be Pokemon, actually. It's been a while since I've been in here. Yeah, you get Porygon or Larvitar. Ooh. Larvitar. I can guess I can go over it here. It's one of the best Pokemon in the game. Competitively, is one of the best Pokemon and still is to this day. It's such a sweet Pokemon. It evolves into Tyrantor at a fairly late level. If you can make room for it on your team, I highly recommend it. It's so good. And here we have the game corner, which has amazing music. And I guess I will buy some coins. I really had no other use for my coins at this point in the game. Or for my money, anyway. And you can buy prizes. Oh, next door. Okay. So I know we've already done the... Ooh, what the heck? Choose a card. Place your bet. Uh, I do not know what I'm doing. Uh, I'll put here. Oh, Wait, you have to guess what card it is? Well, that's stupid. Oh, man, it was level 5, too. I would have won a ton of money. The odds of winning this game are fairly slim to none, though. You have... Oh, I guess they do go away. It's giving your, your chances of winning make it better, I guess. But I... This... This is... No... I do not like this at all. Oh wait, I won? Oh, that's pretty cool. Uh, no, that game is pretty hard, I think. I'm not about that game anymore. <laughs> Do these people give you money? Or... Or no. No, these people give you probably a description of the game. Gahaha, ha, ha. the coins just keep popping out. Ooh, what kid? You wanna play? I'll share my luck with you. And you get coin. We get coin. Alright guys, we're definitely gonna roll one in the dough now. I think the slot machine will pay out. The odds vary among machines. Or it's just completely random if you win. The slot machines are all state of the art. Oh, gambling. It's this machine I want. It cleaned me out yesterday, so it should pay out today. Goodness, people. Gambling is not okay. <laughs> Please don't do this, unless you wanna... Unless you know how to leave when you're about to lose, or you know when you've won. And of course we find the wild Pokemon while surfing in this grass. Or surfing in this grass. Wow, my throat just died there for a second. <laughs> we have a Grimer. I'm not about that life, so we're just gonna run away from it. I wanna talk to you, though. Grimer have been appearing lately. See that pond out in front of the house? Grimer lived there now. Where did they come from? This is a serious problem. I think in the original game, someone would give you a TM for soft-boiled here. I don't remember too much off the top of my head, but I think that's exactly what they did. Now in here we have a diner. Hi! We're holding an Edathon contest. We can't serve you right now, though. You're unfortunate. Crunch, crunch, crunch. I can keep eating. More chef! <laughs> don't talk to me. You'll break my concentration of eating. Well, I guess eating is a thing to focus on. 
I'll take one of the over quality. I'm happy when I'm full. Well, I mean, I want a food. I want my food to taste good too. I mean, you can't just eat everything. And wait, what's in? Is there anything in this trash can? <gasps> the leftovers, though. Really? Oh my goodness! I need this right now in my life. All right, hold on. I need to. I need to use an item. I know this is dumb. I want to use an item so bad. Uh. Wow, my team's got really destroyed from fighting Sabrina. Uh, crap. You know, give this to Earthquake. No, this is seriously the issue. This is important. Leftovers is, like, the best item in the game. Leftovers. You can only get one. It makes it so each turn, I believe, you heal 1 16th of your HP per turn. Oh, this is such a good item, and I want to put it on somebody so bad. The Quick Claw on Bro is still really nice. I'll figure that out too, but I need to. I want to hold on to that item because it's such a good item. Oh my goodness, I completely forgot about getting those. Holy macaronis! All right, is there anything up here? Is there a hidden item up here anywhere? Yes, and another PPO. I'm going to the Pokemon Center to clear up my inventory. I'll see you guys in just a second. Alrighty, guys, so I am back, and let's go ahead and pick up this PP up because, well, with the PP up and it's a nice item, I've already wasted mine just to get the leftovers, so I figured I might as well get them now. Is there anything here? Really? Nothing? Alrighty, well, in order to get to the gym, yes, there is a gym here, you're gonna need cut for it, so we'll be sure to do that next time. But I think I've done everything I wanted to do here, talk to everybody. The only thing I wanted to do now is to heal. Because my Pokemon are seriously injured from the battle against Sabrina. But like I said, we're going to go through a gym mostly once per video. One, once every other video. That just makes sense because the region is not that big. And I've already went over this before. Let's talk to you guys. Ha! Huh? Oh, you seen? Have I heard there has been fresh rumors of a rainbow-colored Pokemon appearing at Tin Tower? I've just had my party healed, so now I'm heading to Ecritique. I'll be seeing you, Jamie. Oh yeah, that's right. Team Rocket's hideout is in the basement of the game corner. Oh wait, that was three years- Oh, three years ago was when they did the thing? I thought it was two years ago. Am I stupid? Probably. Probably. Alrighty, well, I'm gonna go grab a Pokemon with Cut now. So, let's go ahead and do that. I know I'm just stalling for time, but... Uh, why not? What Pokemon's not gonna be useful in this gym whatsoever? I guess Bro won't be, so I'll deposit him. And I'm gonna bring out my good old cut slave. Where is my boy? Where's my boy? There you are, my boy. My little, little good old slave. I believe in gold, silver, and crystal, when you put a Pokemon in the PC and take it out, it doesn't heal it. I don't think that's until the later games where it does that. But next time on Pokemon Crystal, though, we're gonna be heading into the Celadon City Gym and take on the gym leader. I think this is gonna be a pretty easy bad uh, gym. So, this gym is great. Only girls are allowed here. Oh boy, what a creeper. Alrighty, guys. So, with that being said, thank you guys so very much for watching. And I will see you guys next time for some more Pokemon Crystal. See you guys then.